Okay, so you're probably wondering, Marie, what the heck is that? <laughs> All right, so before we get into what the heck is that, I wanna share with you guys why I got to this point. So there are a bunch of people that are very asleep nowadays. I am not one of those people. So I am always watching the news and anybody who follows me knows <laughs> that I am like keeping on, on top of everything, right? So if you were paying attention back in January of 2020, when Colby um's helicopter went down there was a huge article in usa today and if you would have been paying attention to the left of that article you can still google it so you know i'm not lying to you right to the left of that article it says let me see rush is on to develop vaccine for coronavirus but nobody saw that because everybody's attention was on colby's helicopter going down I paid attention, I saw it. <laughs> so I started putting some plans into place. That's another story. So anyway, <clears throat> fast forward to 2023, I started noticing some things happening. So in February, there was a train derailment. I'm checking all my notes because I wanna make sure I don't miss anything with you guys. Okay, so in February, actually February 23rd, there was a train derailment in Ohio that leaked a bunch of junk into the water and it started making the water too toxic to drink. Okay, in March, 2023, Minnesota had to have a huge water cleanup. <clears throat> in March, the same, same month, there was a toxic radiation problem with Texas water. We recently just had our water analyzed and they told us that there are now for a ton of forever chemicals in our water supply. These are chemicals that will never leave your body ever. Okay, and recently there have been a bunch of these military camps like Camp Lejeune and all these where they've had to evacuate. I mean, people have left vehicles and everything else because they have evacuated these military compounds because the water was just so toxic. So people, they're messing with your water. <laughs> Believe it or not, it's like I'm seeing it everywhere. They are messing with your water. Okay, so try to keep your eyes open, try to stay alert and pay attention because it's really important right now. So recently, the last thing that did it for me was uh, Berkey water filters. I've had friends that have owned Berkey's for years and years and years. Well, all of a sudden, the uh, EPA decided that they were gonna ban Berkey filters, okay? After all these years, because they cause cancer, um, it, it was a whole, Thing. If you want to look it up online, you can, but it was like third, three third party issues and pesticide claims and I mean, all sorts of stuff and they banned them. So, um, you know, there was all this problem with getting clean water. I didn't keep track of it, but there was also, I believe it was Chicago. Don't quote me on that where like the whole, like it was cities. <laughs> that went without clean water and they were unable to find any clean water bottle supplies anywhere, like within two states. So we saw it happen in COVID, right? Where we ran out of bottled water and all this stuff. So next thing I know, I'm like on the internet going, I need to find a source, right? Because if they're messing with my water, um, listen, people, you can, sit there and, and not eat for an entire year and you're gonna be fine. But clean water, you can't go without. So um, I started sitting there and really researching all over the internet, trying to find what can I do? And I know, I know that there's a bunch of different ways that you can clean your water. Don't come at me with that, you know, and all the comment, I know, all right? I know you can even use crystals, to, what are that? But I wanted something that was proven, I wanted something that was scientific, and I wanted something that was gonna work, just in case, because you never know. Okay, I know, call me crazy, but I am one of those people, I'm not a conspiracy theorist, or I don't consider myself one, but I am one of those people <laughs> 
that has a box underneath my bed that is the to-go box in case the ish hits the fan. <laughs> so if you want to call me a conspiracy theorist, then it is. Hey, it may never happen. Everything's good, right? So we don't have to worry. So that box can just remain there and collect dust and it's all good. But I've always been the type of person that it's always better, you know, like plan for the worst, but expect the best, right? Better safe than sorry. So in 2021, after this whole COVID thing, um, Jaden and Willie decided to set out to do something and which I think is fantastic. And that's what I want to introduce to you guys today. That is what you saw at the beginning of this video. And it's called Luma. Luma is literally the future of hydration. I love hydration. I don't know. I know some of you know this, but I am a water bottle geek. I own like multiple. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to leave it there. I own multiple water bottles, right? I have a whole cupboard. <clears throat> we won't go into that. But this bottle is especially dear to my heart because it cleans the water with UVC light, right? Technology. So you open up the little thing. You can see the little light in there. See it? And then you... Do the clicky dealy okay it's even safe where if you because you can't look at it with your eyes right so if i were to like a kid being all you know nosy and stuff you know how children are they're all inquisitive they're going to sit there and turn it on it's like oh what's that they're going to hurt their eyes so the technology of this is wonderful it's all it's got all the wonderful stuff inside so it stays cold it will actually stay cold for eight hours it's eight, an eight hour insulation but once you close it, you can hit the clicky dealing and it will actually clean your water. So, and it cleans your water in like seconds. So I want to give you some information on this because if you're interested, let me tell you, you, I'm going to get ready to blow your mind, right? Okay. So number one, this has got an eight hour insulation. I researched a bunch of bottles i looked through a bunch of stuff and i was like oh, okay no until i reached um luma okay so it's got a one more than one month so month plus some a battery life so if you charge it it comes with the little charger so if you charge it so you can charge it in your car um you know just in case um, so you can charge it in your car and it will give you a longer than a month life on the battery. Okay. It, um, like I said, it has eight hours of insulation, so it'll stay cold. It's warranty protected. So you're not going to get screwed. It's, it's warranty protected and there are options to upgrade. This is a 1.0. I'm sure they're going to be upgrading, right? You always want to upgrade. So there's always the options to upgrade later and you can buy, um, not you can buy, but you get the warranty protection with the bottle. So you know you're covered. Okay, so put your, hear put your hearing in and listen to what I'm about to say. This bottle, it's UVC light, it actually breaks down DNA and RNA bacteria and viruses. Did you hear that? Those who know, know. Listen to that again. This bottle will actually break down DNA and RNA in bacteria and viruses. So, but it will also help with fungi and mold spores. Okay, so basically this is the future because I started doing a bunch of research and during my research, I found out that they're gonna be using this UVC technology um, to sanitize swimming pools, to sanitize ponds, um, to sanitize, I wish I had in my notes, um, ponds. Another thing is, you know those um, freezers that you go into like Walmart, whatever, Walgreens, and, and you're going to get your frozen foods? Every time you grab one of those handles, those handles contain 1,200 more bacteria than your cell phone or a toilet seat. 
Okay, the same with a grocery cart. So what this technology is gonna do in the future is they're actually gonna use this UVC light and they're gonna make tunnels and they are gonna run your grocery carts through these tunnels, shine them with that, this UVC light in order to sanitize them. So when they come out the other end, you can grab a cart and you're not gonna catch, um, you know, like I said, any fungi, any mold, spores, any bacteria, any viruses. They're gonna keep the viruses contained like this. Okay, they're also gonna go in and they're going to put it in the air systems. So it's going to sanitize the air systems with this light. So they're, this is gonna be like a huge thing. I mean, they are gonna sanitize everything with this. They're gonna use these lights in almost everything. So this is literally, these guys, these two young, unbelievable, insanely intelligent people have like, they're in the future already. They are doing with water um, what they intend to do all over the planet um, in years to come. It's got the little thing in there where you plug in and then it's got the clicky button <laughs> on the bottom. All right, so I'm like, people, I love this bottle. <laughs> I love this bottle. Okay, so I want to help you. How can I help you get this message, this idea, this bottle to the masses? I, I want to help you. Okay, so I didn't get my own link. You know, it happens sometimes. It's all right. So if you go to, let me make sure I got it right, drink, drinkluma.xyz, you can actually read up on all this stuff of this bottle and everything else. But these guys were nice enough to give me a code because I'm like, hey, I got followers. Hey, I want to bring this to my followers. I think that a lot of them would really be interested in this technology, right? So on your way out, as you're checking out, if you get one, please use the co code HEAL in all upper caps, H-E-A-L 20, and they are going to give you 20% off. All right. So, you know, go ahead and go to their website, check everything out and try to support these two young entrepreneurs. I mean, this is like, I was like blown away because I really did research a lot of bottle. As I said, I'm a bottle geek. I researched a lot of these bottles and I'm like, hey, okay, <laughs> one for the gym. So when I run out of water, I can go to the nasty water and fill it up and put my cap on and hit the clicky button and wait 30 seconds and I've got myself clean water and one for my, in case the ish hits the fan box. So there you go. Um, I would love to see you guys try it. I think it is just excellent. And as I said, they are messing with your water. And now that you've heard it from me, try to keep an, an, an open mind and try to keep an, an, your eyes open for that, okay? Keep tabs of that and you're gonna start seeing it everywhere, how they're messing with the water supplies, right? And I think one of the reasons that they're messing, this is just my little idea. I think they're messing with the water supplies because they don't want you growing your own food. But that's just me. So anyway, you didn't hear it here. <laughs> there you go. All right. So stay happy. Stay healthy. Get yourself a UVC bottle and start killing those RNA and DNA bacterias <laughs> so that you can be nice and healthy because healthy water is, I can't even begin to express how important water is and how important healthy water is for your cells, for your eyesight, for your brain, for your hair, your nails, everything. I mean, we are like, we're basically made out of water, water and some minerals, you know, everything is. You look at all the healthy ecosystems, 
water and a few minerals, water and a few minerals. So it's very important that we stay healthy that way. All right, till we meet again, please love and respect one another. Bye-bye.